How about an encouraging story of the day to finish 2013? Because yes. All right. Hey, by the way, if you've got one of these, you can just call us. Oh, we'd love to hear your story. Just tickles our heart, and it just encourages so many people all over the nation. Share your story, 800-900-1300. And if this story, you think this will help somebody else, you want to hear it again, it'll happen in two hours from now. This is what happened with Brian, doesn't it? In 1997, I was losing everything. My wife, my job, my family, because of drinking and being just such an obnoxiously rude and angry person. So the night before I had surgery for diverticulitis, and we're removing 12 inches of my colon, I accepted Jesus. Oh. And it wasn't just a thing to say, God, if you get me through this, I'll serve you. It was, God, I've got nothing left. If you're real, please save me and show me your love. And the next morning, the doctor could not believe I was the same man. He almost didn't want to operate on me because I looked good. Yeah. It was it was amazing that he's like, what happened last night? I said, I accepted Jesus. I don't care if I live or die. You know? <laughs> so could he tell that something physically changed or was it your attitude? He could see. It was almost like the encounter that I had with Jesus was visibly apparent to the doctor. And I love what you said. One of the things that changed in you is all of a sudden it sounds like fear just disappeared because you said you didn't care if you lived or died. Now you had Jesus. Uh, I, it didn't matter now. I mean, I knew I was losing everything, but I wasn't going to have to die and live an eternity in hell. And just went out and just gave a testimony that Jesus is real and he can change your life if you accept him and just allow him into your life.